what's up welcome back to my channel I know it's been a long time but I thought it would be really cool to uh, show you guys a makeup look for today I went to Trader Joe's picked up these pretty flowers here and decided to do an orange look to match the flowers today so if you'd like to see how I created this look keep on watching what's up guys I've already finished my eyebrows off camera I've also moisturized my skin as well as primed I'm still using the Milani face primer Still works very well for me. To start off today's eyes look, I'm going to be using three different palettes. So the first palette that I'll be using today is from the um, Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. And it's called Sauced. And it's just a nice neutral tone. Just buffing that all over the lid. Now we'll be using the Dominique Cosmetics palette in Celestial Thunder and we'll be using the shade Lunar Eclipse. So that's this really bright orange here. And I'll be picking that up on another fluffy brush. I wanna go for a spotlight eye today so I'll be focusing that mainly on the um, outer and inner corner of the eye and then I'll be tossing a shimmer in the shade. I'll be tossing a shimmer shade in the center. <laughs> First I'm packing the color on to get some nice pigmentation and then I'm lightly blending up. On a more defined brush I'm going to go into Storm Dust. So that's just a little deeper orange color here for a little more dimension and depth. These colors are blending really nicely together. But anyways, what have y'all been up to? It's been a really long time since I've actually recorded a makeup video. Most of the things I've uploaded have been vlogs, which is really fun. We had a really nice visit from Nick's parents a couple weeks ago, and then my mom and brother came in to town to visit for a whole week. So we got some time off and got to relax and just kind of go around to the stores that were open um, and had a good time you know as much as we could given the circumstance and this is looking really good so far I think it's time to pop on that shimmer shade I'm just thinking about what I want to do mm -mm -mm. no actually I think I'm gonna go back into the naked heat palette we're gonna use lumbre let's see what am I picking this up on I'm gonna be using a flat brush so it'll be my morphe e10 there we go, this nice flat brush. So first I'll try it with this and if it doesn't give the payoff that I'm wanting, then I'll just use my finger. Alrighty, we're in business, boom! What I want to do before the eyes are finished is go back into that Celestial Thunder palette and use that first orange shade, but I'll focus that more on the inner corner of my eye. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. My eyeshadow is pretty much finished. So what I'm gonna be doing next is moving on to my eyelashes and eyeliner. Um, my eyeliner, I am still not confident in doing on camera yet. So I'm gonna go off camera and do a wing liner and then I'll also put my false lashes on. So just a sec. Ooh, I'm back. Wing liner is on and so are the falsies. For my wing liner, I'm using the Kat Von D uh, Tattoo Liner. It is my favorite liner to use. The applicator is just super easy. Like, I keep trying out different eyeliners, but I always go back to this one. The lashes that I used are from Lily Lashes. Um, I don't know the style though. Um, if I happen to find the box, I will totally link it down below. But for now, our eyes are complete. 
next thing we're going to be doing is moving on to the rest of the face which is going to be a little funny because I'm pretty sure this foundation doesn't match my skin tone anymore <laughs> it's the Milani conceal and perfect two-in-one foundation awesome sauce uh, next thing we're going to move on to is concealer still using my Tarte Shape Tape this one is in light neutral which I also am pretty positive is no longer my shade but hey I'm gonna use it up until it's all gone oh my gosh yeah this is not my shade <laughs> what else it's all good Now I'm going to set my under eyes with the Kylie Cosmetics powder. Just going to dip into that with my beauty blender. Whoops. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. And we're going to let that shit bake like a cake. Moving on to our next item. God, what is that? I don't even know what that is. What are we doing? Okay. Haha, <laughs> bronzer. I am going to be using Give Me Sun by MAC Cosmetics. I'm using a Morphe R7 brush and then lightly apply, bringing some color back into my cheeks. Show that around the forehead. Messing up my hair. <laughs> and then just a little down the nose. I'm grabbing a brush that doesn't have any product on it right now. Just kind of wiping it across my arm to make sure. And then what I'm going to do is wipe away the bake. Ooh, she's looking nice. So I'm still using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit Palette. Gosh, that backlight right there. Boom. Okay, so bronze and summer is what I'm going to be using. And to pick that up, I'll use a Morphe M510 fluffy brush. I'm gonna add just a little bit of blush. Today I'll be using Happy Go Rosy by MAC. Nice pink tone there. And I'm lightly tapping in using my Y3 blush brush. You're gonna be struggling to find a mirror. Finishing up today's look, I will be using Hot Fire. This was the Dose of Colors collab with uh, Katie and Desi Perkins. So what is this crazy bright orange shade? Like an orange red shade. Just a, just a bright pop of orange, just a little one. <laughs> Oh gosh, all right y'all, this is this is the complete look. If you would like to check out the photos that I am taking with this makeup look here, then be sure to head over to my Instagram and give it a little like. I hope that you guys are staying safe and that you enjoyed this makeup look and enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for watching, bye.